and they just stay right here all day. Oh, they right can How many do you have in there? Don't get, don't take oh, oh my, oh my God. God. Let me see. It won't bite me. Nope. These flying squirrels? Yep, this is shit. bear and... And he's just looking to go right back, run right back in. They're so super soft. You got those from I had somebody ship them over. She didn't like the smell of the urine, so she's like, get them out of my house. Okay. When do you want me there? Are they there? bad like cats? <laughs> what do you mean? Like they're they're urine. Do they go in a box? No. It's daytime. Oh, they don't like they're the, nocturnal. Okay, they're nocturnal. That's yeah. really cool. Yeah. Six. <laughs> That's real cool. Thank you. And you're getting a sterling silver heart and necklace today? Yes. Yeah, I looked at this already. I could do it for $15 for the pair. This sounds good. Is it good? It'll fit. I just got to open it up a little bit more. Okay. Look, it's a squirrel. Right here at Westridge Traders. And he's gonna go hide. Oh my gosh. Right here at Westridge Traders, can you get flying squirrels? Good, I'm interested in this guitar. What's uh, your name? Uh, Doug. Hi, Doug Tony. Tony. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Nice to meet you. So what's the deal with this? This guitar actually kind of has an interior sound that these two little, because this metal um, disc that's in the middle vibrates the sound and it comes out of these two. So it's got kind of a built-in speaker system. Oh, cool. um, pretty unique. Uh, it's called, it's made by Morel. We're asking two and a quarter. Are you interested in it? You know, I might be interested in it for about a hundred bucks, but a uh, hundred dollars. Eh, I gotta start low. You gotta let me make a little money. I probably paid more than a hundred bucks oh, for okay. the thing. Well, how about two hundred? Two hundred. I might go up to one one fifty. I guess. Yeah, that's a little light. The split the difference, like they do on TV and the car shows. Yeah, I, we probably can do that. How about one hundred and seventy-five dollars? Okay, I'll take that for one hundred seventy-five. That sound good? Sure. Thank you. Hi, Ed. Hey, I'm just trying to see if you could possibly tell me what this thing is. What do you think, Ed? I don't know. Think, think, we I, should... can, think I can pull your teeth out with it? I guess. Or push them back in. Oh well, yeah, then you got to, I can pull it and then I can fill it with something. You know, just put a little cavity stuff in the bottom of it. And... What do you think? What is it, Ed? Tell me what it is. People watching the show wonder what it is. They would never figure it out. Because I had to look it up and it took me 10 minutes to find out what the hell this thing is. So what did you find out? I found out that this is a actual wine capper, believe it or not. You must put the bottle down, put the cap on, mm -hmm. press this, and then push it down. I don't know. Funniest looking tool I ever saw. For sale at Westridge Traders. For sale. Yeah, I think he's had an awfully rough day. The poor man. Maybe we ought to send him home. Travel. Good night, Gary. How you doing today? Good, how are you? Good. Got a couple items here, huh? Um, uh, a lamp. Got a frame and a lamp. Okay. Interested in purchasing them? How about I do a package deal in a bowl for you? So, 50 bucks for the pair. Just to let you know, this is $89 in the store, and these are $49. So, what do you think? Is that a good deal? I think so. Are you happy with it? Yeah. All right, perfect. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. How's it going? Good, how are you? Good. You got a couple snowmobile helmets? Thank you. Well, what are you looking to do with them? Uh, sell them. Yeah, they're a little older. They're a couple years. Yeah. They had lights even still working on them. Mm -hmm. cool. Both. Beautiful. They had nine guns. That's I'm just trying to get rid of them. I don't really want them. Alright, I'll tell you what. I'll throw you uh, 20 bucks for them. Yep, that's fine. Alright, sounds good. Just need your ID. I'll get you written up. Thanks. Go ahead. Let's go, buddy. How you doing, sir? What you got here? I got some real nice pearl... Opera glasses. Opera glasses. Alright, you got to turn so these guys can see you. 
Yeah, these are neat. They're all in one good condition. Um, they're kind of a generic one. There's no manufacturer's name on it. Typically, do you see one? Yep, right there, sir. That's all of it. Take a quick look for you. Okay. These things typically do between 20 and 30 bucks. Okay. A lot of people think they're all worth a real lot of money, but typically they are not. Right. Um, most of them are made in Paris. Um, yours are luckily they're all a lot of times these Perfect. little mother of pearls crack or fall out, but yours are all in good condition. How much are you trying to get for it? What did you say they go over to? They're, they're worth between let's call it twenty to forty dollars. Okay. So fifteen? Fifteen bucks probably 15 is about fair. where I'm gonna be at if you wanna if you wanna sell them. So okay. yeah, let's do that. Alright, well, thank, thank you, you so much. Reading by Lena. Come on into the popular fortune teller Lena. She will tell you about past, present, and future relationships, answering any and all questions for you. Come into Lena for a Halloween special to be held by Lena, either at her house or yours. Lena will tell you about who is true to you and who is not. She will do your tarot card and palm readings. Walk-ins are always welcome. Reading will start at $10. Call 585 581-0482 or stop in today at 1178 West Ridge Road. Hi Roger, this is Mark from West Ridge Traders. We've added a new line to our collection here at the store. We now have albums. We're buying and selling them. They're all in great condition. Some might be a little scratched, some are. Come on in, check them out. We've got all the name brands here. Leonard Skinner, Aerosmith, Alice Cooper, so on and so forth. They're all here. Come on in, check us out. 1130 West Ridge Road. We're doing e-cigarettes now at the Dewey Avenue Smoke Shop. If you're looking to get a modified e-cigarette, come on down to the Dewey Avenue Smoke Shop. We have lots of hammer mods in stock. You get free candy every time you make a purchase with us at the Dewey Avenue Smoke Shop. We have an assortment of vaporizers for your dry herbs, waxes and oils, concentrates and e-juices, and lots of modified electronic cigarettes. Monroe County Smoke Shop Emporium. Check us out on Facebook. Do we have Smoke Shop? I'm working on computers. I am. We just got in about 30 laptops. We had fresh operating systems put in them, and I'm pricing them all to get them put out for sale. And uh, come on in and get them. There's a great selection of laptops down here at Westridge Traders. Check out the laptops here at Westridge Traders, folks. They're all priced and ready to go. They all have fresh operating systems in them, thanks to BBS Computers at Westridge and North Avenue. Stop in and see us. Have a bottle of water. Look at our computers. Look at everything else in the store. Stop in and see us. 1130 Westridge Road, home of the four-month pond. Monday through Thursday, 10 to 7. Fridays and Saturdays, 10 to 5. Catch us online. Just catch us. It's that time of year again, so make sure you come check us out at Highline Motor Cars for our end of the summer back to school sale. We're marking down prices on all our makes and models. We have Mercedes, BMW, Audi, Cadillac, GMC, Infiniti, and so much more. We even have an international MXT if that's what you need. So make sure you come down to Highline Motor Cars for our end of the summer back to cool sale where quality is our first priority. Hey Rochester, it's Mark from Westridge Traders. I'm here with Sniper from Extreme Graphics. Sniper, where are we located? 1631 Dewey Avenue, Dewey and Stucco. What do you guys do here? Uh, we do tattoos, body piercing, laser tattoo removals, and uh, we do nipple piercings. Buy one, get one free. Yeah, not on me. Yes, I'm not me, not now. Yeah. Yes, yes. And custom free hand work right here at Extreme Graphics. Folks, you gotta come check them out. Hi folks, stop in and see us at Westridge Traders, the home of buy, sell, trade, and pawn. What's a pawn, you ask? It's a collateral loan. Bring your items of value into us, we'll assess the value to it. You can borrow money against it and you have four months to get your items back. Yes, four months. And we'll extend that term also. So stop in and see us, 1130 Westridge Road. Visit us on our website at westridgetraders.com. We're here Monday through Thursday, 10 to 7. Fridays and Saturdays, 10 to 5. Catch us here.
How are you doing today? I'm doing pretty well. Nice yeah. to see you again. You got some estate coins I see here to settle, huh? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, I looked through them all. They're pretty worn, most of them. There isn't any with any real good detail, so they're about, you know, good to fine. Uh -huh. I went through all my pricing, and um, I mean, full retail on them is probably worth a hundred and. Fifty dollars. It's full retail. It means I got to get rid of all these coins. Um, I'm going to give you a hundred bucks if you want. Um, how about a hundred and five? Well, I was going to say ninety, but I went up to a hundred. So. Well, how about a hundred and five? Okay. <laughs> Done. Isn't that good? Thank okay. you. Okay. Hi, Cheryl. Hey, how are hi, you? I'm good, thank you. I was wondering about pawning my TV here. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah, could you maybe give me like uh, at least thirty for it? I'll say 32. <laughs> yeah, that'd, be, that'd be awesome. Thank you. I'll be back again, of course. And you guys are always friendly. Thank I, by the way, I, I know all you by name almost. Yes, you do. And, uh, and what is my almost name? Almost a fixture. Don't you guys pawn me? <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me take my teeth out. So you're the one that, that uh, I like to look up ciphers names. all the names, right? I, I like names. So what's Anthony mean? Anthony, Anthony means priceless. Uh, yeah, that's me, yeah. priceless. Edward Edward means guardian, of course, and, and, yeah. and Mark means... And Lord. Linda's my wife's name, and what, what does that stand for? Linda, Linda means snake. Oh, boy. <laughs> it didn't say snake in the grass, though. No? No. <laughs> Just plain snake? Just plain snake. I'll make sure I tell her that. You never did tell her, did you? No. Yeah. <laughs> I, I would only do it when you're fighting. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't do it when things were going good. <laughs> and then I'll say, if you only knew what your name meant. <laughs> but that's what it means. And, uh, well, I appreciate it. You guys always help me out in the pinch. You Thank really you. Do. You're always friendly, always courteous, and always on time. Okay. We'll build up your pond, no much. problem. All right. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. All right. Hi, Lisa. How are you today? I'm good. Thank you. How are you? Good. We're looking for a bike. Well, I am looking for a bike, but I remember these old banana seat bikes. This is a Schwinn that they actually, it's a repro, made by Schwinn though. It's, oh. it's a, it's, it was popular during the, the, you know, early to middle 60s, they had the banana seat, some of them had the little shifter on it, three wheels. Yeah. This one here is just a plain one without the shifter on it, but believe it or not, they get some money for these things. Yeah, I used yeah. to have a purple one, I still have it, it's in my, mo it's my, it's my mother's thing. You have, have an purple. original one? I do, it's purple and it's got a white. It's got a white seat with flowers on it and a flower basket. Is the seat? It's, the seat's a banana. Does the seat, seat have any cracks in it? I haven't seen it in probably ten or fifteen years. I haven't been out there. Bring it in because we're interested in looking at it. If it's yeah. an original, absolutely, one hundred percent. It was my first bike and I remember it. I love it. And I, my mom told my mom never get rid of it. <laughs> no, they're actually gained in value. Believe it or not, and the Schwinn is the one with the banana seat that are, it's the most collectible. Mm -hmm. so. I had a little basket with flowers on it, one of the little uh -huh. white baskets with the flowers and that's my seat. No kidding. <laughs> the little streamers. <laughs> Yeah, that's um, as far as the banana seat wise. That's the only one I have like that. We got BMX bikes, we got beach cruisers, we got uh, mountain bikes, hybrid bikes. That's a beach cruiser. They're very popular now. Yeah. You don't have to change gears or whatever. You just go straight, go forward. I have one of these when I live in California on the beach. You got the wide tires, so they're yeah. good for most uh, any kind of uh, all terrain. Yeah. Sure do. I love to ride bikes. We'll give you a good deal when you're ready. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a good day, you too. Hey, how's it going? Good. How are you doing today? So you got a few tools here. Yeah, I'm retired now, and I'm getting rid of a wall 18 volt, got some case sockets set, got a fluke. Um, what are you thinking? Uh, 80 bucks. I, I would if this was a 20 volt. It's an 18 right volt, a little right older, about four years old. The fluke's a little older, and it's a basic one. I'll tell you what, I'll go 55 dollars. Sounds good. All right, just need your ID, get your written up. There you go. Thank you. Reading by Lena. Come on into the popular fortune teller, Lena. She will tell you about past, present, and future relationships, answering any and all questions for you. Come into Lena for our Halloween special to be held by Lena, either at her house or yours. Lena will tell you about who is true to you and who is not. She will do your tarot card and palm readings. Walk-ins are always welcome. Reading will start at $10. Call 585-581-0482 or stop in today at 1178 West Ridge Road.
Rochester, this is Mark from Westridge Traders. We've added a new line to our collection here at the store. We now have albums. We're buying and selling them. They're all in great condition. Some might be a little scratched, some aren't. Come on in, check them out. We've got all the name brands here. Leonard Skinner, Aerosmith, Alice Cooper, so on and so forth. They're all here. Come on in, check us out. 1130 Westridge Road. The Dewey Avenue Smoke Shop has all your smoking needs. When it's time to smoke, come down to the Dewey S. Smoke Shop, 1405 Dewey Avenue. Our cigar selection is the largest in Monroe County. We carry many exclusive brands and some that are very hard to find. As far as smoking accessories and supplies, Dewey has it all. Our variety of pipe tobacco is by far the largest selection in the county. Old favorites and over 200 bulk brands. Sold by the ounce or the pound. Custom blending is always available. Check out our lighter selection from Zycar to Zippo. Thinking of switching to e-cigarettes? We are the area's leader in selection. From disposables to kits to mods, check out our huge selection of e-liquids and e-cigarette supplies. So stop in today to the Dewey Avenue Smoke Shop, 1405 Dewey Avenue in the historic Maplewood neighborhood, Monroe County Smoke Shop Emporium. Check us out on Facebook, Dewey Ave Smoke Shop. Hi folks, stop in and see us at Westridge Traders, the home of buy, sell, trade, and pawn. What's a pawn, you ask? It's a collateral loan. Bring your items of value into us, we'll assess the value to it. You can borrow money against it and you have four months to get your items back. Yes, four months. And we'll extend that term also. So stop in and see us, 1130 Westridge Road. Visit us on our website at westridgetraders.com. We're here Monday through Thursday, 10 to 7. Fridays and Saturdays, 10 to 5. Catch us here. Hey Rochester, it's Mark from Westridge Traders. I'm here with Sniper from Extreme Graphics. Sniper, where are we located? 1631 Dewey Avenue. Dewey and Stucco. What do you guys do here? Uh, we do tattoos, body piercing, laser tattoo removals, and uh, we do nipple piercings. Buy one, get one free. Yeah, not on me. Yes, I'm not me. me, not now. Yeah. Yes, yes. And custom free handwork right here at Extreme Graphics. Folks, you gotta come check them out. I'm working on computers. I am, we just got in about 30 laptops. We had fresh operating systems put in them, and I'm pricing them all to get them put out for sale. And uh, come on in and get them. There's a great selection of laptops down here at Westridge Traders. Check out the laptops here at Westridge Traders, folks. They're all priced and ready to go. They all have fresh operating systems in them, thanks to BBS Computers at Westridge and North Avenue. Stop in and see us. Have a bottle of water. Look at our computers. Look at everything else in the store. Stop in and see us, 1130 Westridge Road, home of the four-month pond, Monday through Thursday, 10 to 7, Fridays and Saturdays, 10 to 5. Catch us online, just catch us. It's that time of year again, so make sure you come check us out at Highline Motor Cars for our end of the summer back to school sale. We're marking down prices on all our makes and models. We have Mercedes, BMW, Audi, Cadillac, GMC, Infinity, and so much more. We even have an international MXT if that's what you need. So make sure you come down to Highline Motor Cars for our end of the summer back to cool sale, where quality is our first priority. I see you got a couple of half dollars here. Yes. Okay, so we've got a, uh, a 64 half dollar. It's in halfway decent shape, actually. Looks like it may have been clean, but I'm not 100% sure. And then we got a 1946 that looked like a BB stopped it. <laughs> it's got a nice little hole in it. Um, damage on that. I'll tell you what, I'll do eight dollars for the pair of them. I can buy them for it. Yes. Is that all right? Yes, it sounds great. All right, yep. thanks. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Hi, Ed. Good morning. Good morning, Mark. I'm here at Extreme Graphics. Uh huh. Finishing up my tattoo, uh -huh. and I brought a lunch. You know, I got to have food. I'm always eating. Oh yeah. It's amazing how I keep this girlish figure. Yep. Just like you. Oh yeah. But just like me. Yes. <laughs> well, let's go in and see him. Let's get it done. Pushing into the background, making the waves look like waves. This part doesn't hurt as bad. Oh, no, my God, the outline is killing. 
to the collarbone, huh? Well, so right now, Sniper's making me remember his name. He's got it, like, right there on the collarbone. It feels like it anyways. Happy places. The warm, fuzzy bunnies and unicorns. Yes, yeah. Better getting hit by a car. <laughs> January, I'll let you know when we're getting closer to that. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. We have today, and we added on to all this stuff, we didn't do the coloring last time, so this time we're doing the coloring, so all the blue shading wrapping around the waves. We the first layer of the light blue, we're going to come up with a darker blue, give it some depth on it, and then add a little bit more shading in the background and some white highlights, and we'll be done. This spot over here, we're gonna have a little shading right underneath here, but it's right up next to his nipple. So if you wanna catch his face, we'll buy the nipple. Ha <laughs> 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 Save the best for last. They're gonna pay me, and I worked on his neck. Exactly right. Another guy worked on one hand, another guy worked on the other hand. So we had three of us tattooing at the same time. For two hours, two and a half hours. Oh my God. I took her earring out of her ear. Why did you take it out? Uh, she wanted it out. She's your Cool, let's see your ear. Right there. Alright, think it was getting infected or what was going on with it? Yeah, it was a little bit swollen, so I needed to come out to breathe. Alright, now we are doing some, doing some filling with white. Do the happy places. All right, sniper. Okay, uh, you, you got you got to talk to me through this. Got any good stories? Okay, so we got a yeah. My my, my one buddy, he's a midget, dwarf. Not even a dwarf. He's under three feet tall, and he's like 28 years old. So we used to bring this guy out bar. I used to pay him to come out bar because <laughs> it was the best thing in the world. If you want to send a girl a shot, you pick the midget up, you set him on the bar, I'm run it and he runs down with a shotgun. It was the best. The best thing in the world. I gotta get one. I would pay him to work the front desk sometimes, and all you would see is fingers at the desk. <laughs> Can I help you? <laughs> it was awesome. Oh, that's worth if it. If I could get him back and throw him in scuba gear in the fish tank. Oh my god. That'd be spectacular. Remember when they did, uh, what was the name of the bar? It was the one Bernardo Avenue. Um, is it Maxwell? Tom Monroe? Monroe by the Antelope? Fat cats. Fat cats. Fat cats. Across from fat cats. Kitty corner from fat cats. Where was that dive bar on the corner? Oh, the bug jar? Kitty corner from the bug jar. Woody's. Woody's. Woody's, yes. But after it was Woody's, it was something else. We did midget bowling there. Yeah, we did midget bowling there one time. And we put the midgets in like these orange rain slickers with handles on the back of them. And we squirted baby oil across the floor with bowling pins and we rolled with the midgets with the helmets on. And we did it. We had a tournament going. And then if it, whatever the handicap association that got involved, it said that was inhumane and blah blah blah. And you're, but they you paid them to do it. They didn't mind, right? No, they didn't mind at all. I love midgets. They absolutely love it. There's a underground bar down in New York City. It's down right up right, right by China, between Chinatown, a little early. That little bottleneck right there. Right. A little place called Slickers. And if you go there, there's three holes in the floors. There's midgets down inside the holes wearing yellow rain jackets, and you pay five bucks to pee in the midget. <laughs> Tell me what to do. Virgil's, you out, to, Virgil's on his way down. Yeah, you should bring right there. Bring him nothing but five dollar bills. Better than the twenties you were throwing at the bartender in Florida. Oh, With the girls that were squatting over the holes in the floor, I would have became a midget any day. <laughs> so what are you doing here? Oh, I'm just looking at some of this Dyson vacuum cleaner. How's it going, buddy? Pretty good. You got her all charged up. That's yeah. good. How much are you trying to get for this thing? About 50 bucks. Would have been nice if somebody cleaned it one of these times. Yeah. A lot of hair in this thing. Looking fine. Yeah, I'll do a 50 on it. All right, sounds good. Tony. Vito, nice to meet you. Glad to meet you, buddy. Bringing back your citizen? Yeah. Okay. You're going to do a pawn with it, right? Yes. Okay, we're going to do a $50 pawn. 
We're a true pawn shop, so you get 120 days to get your stuff. Okay. Um, you have up to four months. Um, just watch your stuff over here. This tells you exactly how much it's going to be. And you've done it before, so you know it's in safe hands. Yes. Yeah, and uh, that's about it, Mike. All righty. All right. Thank you. Thanks. What do you think, Tony? I think it's old. I think I don't want to deal with it. So you've got a full-size piano, huh? Yep, yeah, full-size. When is it from, do you think? I have no clue. <laughs> it was given to us from my aunt. Well, this is pretty old. If I had a guess, it's probably from the 30s or 40s. They're extremely, extremely, extremely hard to sell. First and foremost, luckily this is an upright. If you had a regular one, almost impossible to get rid of. Um, I don't know who you talked to here, but you didn't talk to me because I would have no, told you I... not to bring it. Okay. Um, unfortunately, I don't even know what to tell you to go. There is a few piano places in Rochester. I'm going to Yellow Pages, call them what you got. I don't even see a make on you know who paints this. Merrill, that's, yeah, Merrill, that's what my aunt said. Merrill? But who knows, I don't know if she There's a couple of... Three or four people that work on pianos, you want to go in the Yellow Pages, call them up, tell them what you got, and if you're not asking a lot of money, because you probably ain't going to get up, this has all been repainted. Mm -hmm. This was probably a nice color wood at one time, and somebody mm -hmm. just took and painted it black, which I'm sure devalued it. Yeah. But somebody to repair it might want to strip the thing, bring it back, and work on it, but nothing for me. Okay. I'm sorry. That's man. all right. I guarantee you, I don't know who you got on the phone, but I wouldn't have told you to bring it here. Really? Okay. Yeah. Oh, 40 bucks. Yeah, no, I'll pay. Nothing for the... That's the tattoo, huh? Sniper strikes again. He's the best. Extreme graphics. Do we have him? Come check him out. Now we got to hear your You ready? All right, come on. <laughs>